going into double overtime, now your pants are off. You're really yeah. fucking good with you with the boys. Yo, that's like disgusting. This guy just yeah. showed me. I mean, what is the shit you gotta show? They're like, who the fuck is Juan? Juan's the man. Juan is classic. the fun. Yeah, Juan, my secondary. Well, Juan is like Savan after like my a second person now. What's going on, guys? We are back in Canada. Tour's done. 13 weeks. Bodies are an absolute blender. And uh, what we wanted to do with these next four episodes, so all of December, we want to give you guys an in depth recap of the entire trip. So that means behind the scenes stories. That means questions from you guys which we asked on our instagram for you guys to let us know and on our youtube comments we got questions from you guys and we also have just some listings some top moments from the from the trip ranking the hottest girls best tailgate the whole nine yards so we're going to start off with four schools then three three and three and uh i think you guys are going to really like this one because you guys always ask us for in-depth stories behind yeah. the scenes shit so uh, this is never before or never talked about. And we're gonna start it off today with the man of the fucking hour. Steph! 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 Round of applause for the kid. Steph is back. Definitely the number one question that anyone has been asking, Instagram, YouTube. I mean, I had to take care of school because I'm doing my last year in school, but I'm finally back with the boys, so I think that's all that matters now. Also, in, in a later story, you'll find out what happened. Oh, but, okay, true. But last two weeks, I've just been at home, at school, taking care of business. All right. Fuck yeah. Short and sweet. Steph's back. You had to leave early for school. Um, that's why you're gone also in Ohio State. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, and I, the week I was gone in Ohio, I also came back for school. For one week. So we don't need any more comments being like, where the <laughs> fuck is Steph? Like, you know the Either you didn't watch the YouTube video or you're just out to lunch. Yeah. yeah. He's, he's not, he has not left the boys. No, he's, he's still not. a part of the boys. He just has to finish school. How have your DMs been on that? I was curious because we're getting a lot like on our main channel, like on YouTube and Instagram. Like, how have your DMs been? I get the occasional guys who always like try to like, no, no, message me. Like, some guys are already in, but the request, yeah, I saw a couple at the top, so I realized I'm like, I gotta let these guys know. Did you not respond to them? Or did you let a few know? Yeah, I did. Nice. You didn't let everyone know though. Like, well, whoever answered, them? whoever. Okay. Whoever asked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whoever, whoever the main guys who you yeah, message. Yeah, the top guys. Yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. it is. Yeah, yeah, I nice. feel like a lot of them, a lot of the like the boys, thought that like something happened, something yeah. else happened. Especially as like around that time, Matt started to make a lot more appearances in the videos. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, it's almost, yeah. And he, has, and he has a mullet too, so it's like, oh my god, like who's this guy? Where's Steph? I don't know how many people, I think some people have noticed though that I broke, all right, I guess I said it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, some no, some it. people have noticed that I broke my teeth in the video, in the comments. Well, I saw a couple. In if, the you, if you watch back the, the video, it looks like, it looks like. It's the it's the someone's like, made a black eye though. Yeah, I don't know yeah. if <laughs> I had a black eye after Florida I State. I just tired. Yeah. <laughs> just baggy eyes. It did look like something though. I saw it. Yeah, I, I, think it, it I think it could have just been a shadow. The way his hat was sitting, I think it just made a weird look on. Yeah, his I didn't get a black eye. No, I was, I was chilling. I don't know. There, like, yo, the boys got into it. <laughs> yeah, I'm <laughs> like, that's what the fuck? Fat lip, Chip's got a broken eye. Yeah, no, we were, we were good. So enough on that topic. Mm -hmm. Steph's, Steph's here, stay. Never that's that. it. Yeah, Steph's with the boys, so it's just like. There's just, a lot of people that came up to us at the club. So oh my god, like, I know. Like, we're Steph. We're Steph. I'm like. Dude, yeah, send him a DM. <laughs> yeah, that's what we said. Like, send him a DM. Like, uh, he's at home. The actual story. When are we talking about the actual story of what happened? Uh, the last video. The last video. Yeah. Yeah. So the like one of the big reasons is why oh, yeah. he left at the end of week eleven, Florida State. You're gonna see. But you gotta wait till the fourth video, which comes out in four weeks from now. Four yeah. Weeks, yeah. You gotta wait, boys. Yeah. So we're gonna move on to stories from a few schools: mm -hmm. Wisconsin, Michigan, Indiana, and Ohio, Ohio State. State. The first four schools of the trip, Wisconsin was cut in half, so we included this this in the uh, mm -hmm. in the first four. Yeah. Big Ten heavy. This big, big Ten, ten heavy. heavy straight, first straight Big Ten. So starting with Wisconsin, would you guys? Uh, How did you guys like Wisconsin? That was a while ago. Yeah. That was like three months ago. Wisconsin. I think like it, it could have been better. The fact that the frat couldn't have anything kind of really hurt the school. Yeah. But like again, like girls were fucking not. <laughs> yeah, I'm right into it. Like, no, I'm, right I'm, into sure. it. I'm sorry. Like the bar scene was pretty good. The frat could have been better. Like, but they also were hindered because of partying. But the girls there, man, the whole week I was just like, nah, not it. I also all. didn't go to a greatest tailgate. It was not that good. It was just in the backyard. 
Yeah, I think Wisconsin. Not many good stories from Wisconsin. Like it was just an average. I I weekend. think the worst part for me, I guess, with Wisconsin is because it was like it was pretty fucking hyped. Like if you go on a lot of like I don't know like pages on no, 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 websites, it's like Wisconsin, one. Wisconsin. Like this is like who gets like rowdy and shit. And after like the thirteen weeks, looking back on it, it's like like probably not. You know, like yeah. you can find people at other schools that are. I've wanted I've wanted to do Wisconsin more. again though, just because I feel like we didn't give it a fair shake in a sense. It but, was the first one. Yeah, because we also like we're kind of figuring out like They're, what we're like, doing. What with the it. scale is like yeah. everyone's like learning like how yeah. do we like everything was it? technically based off of like Wisconsin. Like yeah. we put Wisconsin at like. On, I would say a, a fair score because like after that like, all the other schools made sense it did it did make like Wisconsin 7 9 for the those that didn't haven't watched the first video like I was I, I was like a little worried at the start too because it was like yo is this like gonna be the best because everyone's saying like this is number one and we gave it like a fucking 7, seven nine. 9 so then I'm like yo fuck how's this series gonna look are we getting at like fives and shit <laughs> but like it did fit with I, all the other schools I mean after going there, there I realized like there's no way this is the number one party school no this chance I knew, I knew no after. chance yeah. there's no way imagine we went there like in November too like when it's freezing oh my months. god dude like it would have got even worse. Oh, dude, the game, no game would have been ass. You just fucking oh bundle up in the cold all day long. <laughs> Freezing. Fuck. It would have been so yeah. bad. To be honest, Wisconsin got lucky that we came there the first week when it was still like really warm out. And they had a really good game against Penn State. Yep. You yeah, have a was great home opener. It was like really electric good. game. Electric. That was their first game back in two years. Two years. It was. Yeah. That was from me there. I don't remember. <laughs> I bought it there. Honestly, I think the best part of Wisconsin that like actually stood out was meeting Cole. Yes, Cole. We met Cole. That was our first. NHL prospect, yeah, yeah. like top prospect. Really like random occurrence too. That was like, so random. But so really we knew fun. he was there because they were on the field. He got the Hober ba Hobie Baker, right? Because they won well, the Big Ten yeah, last year. Big so in the middle, announcing like, their team basically yeah. that like, oh, that they're here, and then like, but again, we didn't think fucking Cole Coffee would pull up to the bar. Yeah. Started, yeah. But we also had one of his teammates, Luke, great guy, Luke, reached out, said, you know, um, come to the KK uh, KK College, College Club, Club. Yeah. great bar. That was probably like that's probably the best spot in Wisconsin. Went there, and then he's like, yo, like, he's like you know, Cole. I'm like, yeah, like we've heard of him. And he's like, hey, he's gonna come. And he came, great guy. Phenomenal so guy. Full of energy. Guy beauty. always has a smile on his face. Man. Yeah, great guy. Just lights up the room. All right, let's stories. move on. Okay. Wisconsin, not many stories. Yeah. Michigan, though, on the other hand. Michigan, Michigan we have full forces. A lot of shit happened yes. in Michigan. Michigan Lock. was a good time. I like Michigan. Michigan, I, I think the city, if we have to look back on it as a whole, like one of the top top two cities that if I had to go to school, like I fuck with the city of Michigan a lot. I think yeah. it's probably the safest city we went to in yeah. like yeah. I, I felt so safe. 100%. There. We went back this past weekend too yeah. for the Michigan hockey team and yeah. it just again, it, it also just reiterated that fact that like oh, yeah. it was definitely the safest city. Like we scootered home at oh, yeah. 4 a.m. I probably yeah. wouldn't do that at any other school we went to. Yeah, probably not. I mean, I, in Ann Arbor, when we were actually there for the first time in the trip, I literally walked home from Skeeps by myself. I don't know. I was all yeah by myself from Skeeps. Forty five minute walk and I did not feel unsafe at any moment of that walk. So, really? Yeah. And you're a big walking home from the bar kind of guy though. Like <laughs> no, go on like random trips like when it's like to go into I do, I've done it once or twice, we'll get into it more as the podcast goes on, but yeah. You're just not an Uber guy, you're just like I'm getting like my just, you know, like day. nice fresh air, you know, it's warm outside, you guys see the vibes, like maybe, <laughs> maybe something cool happens on the walk home. Fair enough. This what what was story, the, what guy. vibes have you seen on a walk home from the trip? I, we'll get into it later. Okay. We'll get into uh, it later. Michigan was good. Learned a new beer pong rule, actually. A redemption, redemption rule that rule. I fucking... I love this rule. This rule was fucking great. And Rick would have loved it, too, if he was yeah. there. Rick would have fucking loved <coughs> because that guy's a little on the edge. But uh, we went to this party, and one one to one cup redemption. Like, let's say the team hits the cup. If the team that's on redemption hits that cup and they hit the redemption, you're now going to overtime. So there's multiple overtimes. I We're really now, like this rule. You get three cups each side. You put two, or no, is it three? Four, and four, four cups. Four four cups. So it's a triangle, and then like a, a one on top, so it's like elevated, which I've never seen before. And then you gotta hit that, and then you're playing the redemption with those four cups. And, and, and you have to out. take off a piece of clothing. Yeah, you gotta is get your tarp kid. first. Your tarp is your first Yes, season. tarp's yep. off. It's tarp's tarp's off. first overtime. For the first, first overtime, overtime tarps are off, but you gotta love. Um, so it's gonna be the three triangle, one on top, and you can't start going for the bottom ones until that top one's hit, which is tough because like I've never fucking played yeah. Hong with an elevated fucking cup. Now yeah. you're changing so many new factors. Yeah. Um, and then if that redemption is hit on that overtime, you're going into double overtime. Now your pants are off. So this gets <laughs> yeah. really fucking good with you with the boys and the ball just just hanging out. 
which you guys did get into a game, right? Yeah. You guys so know. Me and, me and, and Steph, yeah. Steph, the very first time we even played, we didn't, well, played beer pong with these guys. Yeah. yeah. It's like, they they had the overtime rule, and they're like, yo, tarps off, overtime. We're like, what the fuck is this? What, the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> well, what are we doing here? And then second overtime, they're like, all right, take your pants off. <laughs> yes, now. yes. And so like third overtime, if it happened, we lost. We went full naked. We went full naked. Yeah, third overtime's full nudity, which is just, <laughs> God, wow, that is so bad. Bad. I mean, you would have been okay with that. Just because, you know. I mean, I thought you do that that party. Yeah, was, yeah, but like <laughs> I said, you would have been, you know, <laughs> you're, you're showing off to everybody. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. So after that, that same night though, there's more. Yes. Stories. That exact same yes. night, just the the rowdiness continued. We start walking to the bar. Yes. And we're on the way there. We're on some street. <laughs> some guy we're with drops his pants. Can we give him a name? No. no he, po- he points. Can we give him out. a name? He points out first. Let's say Juan. 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 Actually, no. No, we have Juan. I, let's say, his, Juan is. Oh, his I, name. Let's say Jose. 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 Why Mexican names? Uh, <laughs> just just roll, Jose rolls off the thumbnail. Nice okay. Okay. So we're, we're walking to the bar with Jose. With Jose, and then Jose's like, "Look, I'm looking up with this chick." He drops his pants in front of her house and just takes a fucking mean well, dookie and I, all over front lawn. Did anyone else see it? Or was I the only one? I no, saw. I didn't see this shit saw. come out, yeah, but like, I saw him squat. Dude, he, he, he I could He went to with like a leaf and then like just went to the garbage, lifted up the garbage, chucked the leaf, and he's like, "All right, let's go to the bar." So what an absolute, like, just a fucking, just a sicko. A sicko <laughs> in the fucking head to, like, you know, that's, like, disgusting. This guy just yeah. showed me. I mean, when it's a shit, you got to shit. I mean, I mean yeah, nature's, had, yeah. nature calls. He man. definitely had shit after it's still in his ass. No. You think <laughs> well, one good chip, leaf? What, chip, what do you think, bud? <laughs> You've done it once or twice. I don't think it was a lot of shit. So, I mean, oh, wait, what? You've done it. You've done it once or twice. Or you but did do it. shit? No, you had tissues. Did you? Yeah, I, I mean, napkins. Yeah, we have paper yeah. towels. Yeah, I've taken, yeah, I've taken It's a little nicer shit. I've taken, yeah, more, yeah, it's more respectable. Taking a show on the side of the highway. Yeah. You know, rather than, like, your girl's fucking front lawn. <laughs> so that same night, the same <laughs> guy, we're deep into the bar night. Yes. Now. It's yeah. like, what? A couple hours later. 2 a.m. Yeah. Yes. Bar, bar's probably almost about to close. Oh and we're, it's packed. Like, we're at Skeeps. It's fucking packed. Great bar. Number Good one bar. spot in Michigan, for great sure. It, and we're, we're vibing the whole night, having a great time. Towards the end of the night, the, these guys that we're with, Jose especially, know, knows we're giving them a rating. And this yes. is the Saturday night, the last night we're going out. And he's like, yeah, what do I got to do to get the to get the score up? It's rating up. And Chip, what'd you say? And he looks at me. He just, like, looked at me, and I was like... Like, and he didn't like ask me like he's like he wanted to get a good score and I was like I don't know what you're gonna do man he's like he looks at me he does the eye he's like check this out pulls out his limp ass dick <laughs> like aims it down like it's flat aims it down he's staring at me remember he's making eye contact this whole time with me so I'm like looking up and then down like I'm like yo there's no way the son of a bitch is gonna piss in the middle of a fucking dance floor and he starts pissing dude in the middle of the dance floor I'm stunned I've never seen that I've never, I've never, seen never that in before. my fucking life like, we've been to a lot of like bars and clubs everyone just backs up after it gives him room to piss yeah there's like a little now many circle of like no I don't think people are giving him room to piss it was no, like, it was so like, what is going on right some now? Some people were yeah. grossed out, some people were just dying of laughter. Yeah, a little bit of both. Like, yo, what the fuck are you doing? A yeah. little bit, probably because they had a little manpower there, no one's gonna like say, yeah. like, yo, get the fuck out, security doesn't see. Yeah, so I, I don't know how he didn't get kicked out, because I got kicked out that same night for just kicking a table. Yeah. We got <laughs> back in. Yeah, we got back in, but, yeah, got yeah. kicked out. <laughs> I was so pissed when I got kicked out. <laughs> Yeah, I remember. I thought we were leaving. I was like, "Yo, chance you Because I called out. you. I know. Yeah. You I was did. like, "Yo, Chip, like I just got kicked out." Like, and I came fuck. out. And <laughs> so came he out. comes out, yeah. and then the, I'm like, "Yo, like I didn't do shit. Like all I did was kick the table. I didn't break it. Blah blah blah." And I just like was negotiating with this guy for like a solid ten minutes, just like yeah. in his ear. <laughs> and I think he just got fed up with it and let me back in. <laughs> yes. And then I was like, "Let's fucking go." Yeah, we, we got back fired. back up. The boys started firing. That was pretty sick. Wait, that was so sick. <laughs> like, I, after this too, like after we left the club, we went all walked home. We got some like food and shit. Yeah. And then that's when like shit also started getting even fan. more heinous. Like, yes. We're all like a couple drinks deep, just having a good time, and we're just sitting there outside waiting and pizza and stuff. All of a sudden, uh, Jose starts jumping into fucking bushes oh and just God. diving like swimming in there, and we're yeah. just like, "What the fuck's happening?" I think. Chip, he was making up for the ground too. Yeah, was so that? yeah, and, and still, this all has to do with a rating. Remember, keep in mind, this guy's trying to make this Michigan party rating score like the best. And he's like, Chip, dude, I will make up with the fucking ground. I'm like, I'm not, I'm like, I'm not gonna I'm stop. Not gonna I'm not gonna stop, no, you know? Like, what am I gonna say? Like, this is hilarious. 
Um, and he sh- gets on his knees, looks at that ground, and he's like tonguing it. Like he yeah, is he licking. Was We're talking about an outdoor. We're on like a. Like isn't like the, isn't the quad basically kind of like right, right yeah, right yeah we're on a campus, middle, campus. Like middle, yeah. middle outside middle of the fucking campus. This, there's a random dude, you know, just make a blit to blit a belligerently drunk making out with the ground. I'm like, oh my god, like this is fucking like I've never seen this shit. No, before. sure, man, wait, so he sure no, no, sold it. I swear. Oh, he's no. like whipping on the ground and shit, remember? Yeah. And then it yeah. gets worse because he's like, then he's taking his shirt off, like flaying it, throwing it into trees, like he, he's le- a he left the shirt. Though. He left the shirt at the fucking bush there. After that, made up okay. the ground, ended the night, bound down to in front what of the I, I don't yeah. know. Why, I don't know what sorority it was, but we started just bowing down to a sorority. And three then three a.m. in the morning, right when we say bye to each other, he's like, "Yo, one more thing, boys." Takes off his shoes, just no, chucks no. him in the middle the, of the street. The tree as well. We're across yes. the street. He runs across. He sees the tree. He's like, "Fuck this tree!" Yeah. And he starts fucking breaking the tree. Oh, and like man. literally, the tree was just fucking hanging like this out. <laughs> yeah, like it's. And did he did he end up getting out of the ground? No, no, he couldn't get out of the ground, but it was just like fucking completely bent over. The roots are it's just a mess. Yeah, it's just a menace. Yeah. And then he took his shoes off. And then he took his shoes I off, leaving. shocked them, and was like, Happy you know boys. I hope was. I did my job. Wildest. And I guess what? He did his job. Well, yeah. Wildest. Wilds with a fucking girl that didn't leave his fucking sight oh, yeah. the entire <laughs> night. Like, she actually, like, imagine, like, <laughs> just having a girl watch you do all this, and I'm like, Jesus Christ! And you you still, you fucking, still take her home. Yeah, that's mad. And, and and she's like, no, that's just him. <laughs> that's just Jose. I was like, oh fuck, hey man, cheers to Jose. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. there. The Michigan has a lot of stories. What do you think about it? The game was probably the, my favorite game Electric. by far. Yeah, the, getting to the seats of that game was like the hardest it's ever been. Kind of like we missed too much. like what a big chunk just getting yeah. to our seats. It was a hundred and seven thousand deep of people, and like it was just. Non stop, everyone's standing up. It was just fucking heinous to get to your seat. Those pom poms going mad. They're big pom pom guy. Yeah. I wish we would have <laughs> stayed and saw Mr. Brightside, though. Yeah. That's the one that I, I wish yeah. we would have seen. Yes, I do agree with that. All right, moving on to Indiana. This one we got uh, a little fucked. So our Airbnb canceled last minute and <clears throat> we didn't have a place to stay for the weekend. We were going to go. Nice. Nice. Uh, I'm, I'm really <laughs> thirsty, dude, but I can't, I can't interrupt it. I mean. Delicious. So we got a new Airbnb for the middle of the week, and then a hotel, and we we're going to get a hotel in Indianapolis for the weekend. Oh, my God. <laughs> Luckily, tennis players at Indiana hooked up the boys, got to stay at their house for the weekend. It was actually probably a lot more fun than if we it was, yeah. started yeah. to like, stay by ourselves. Big shout out, Patty Fletch. That's the man. Men's, I'm missing. He, he hooked it up, man. Him and his boys, they fucking literally yeah. like the word blessed us is I don't even think. Like, dude, was, driving back an hour to Indianapolis would have just like completely oh, killed and it was ruined it. Every single time. It was parents' weekend, so everyone. And if you know the state of Indiana, Bloomington, there is nothing. There. Piece of shit. Like you can't tell me you go to Bloomington. Yeah, I went to Indiana because I fucking love Bloomington. No, you don't. It sucks. And their area was right in the middle of campus. Piece of shit. Yeah, no, there. Yeah, yeah. Like theirs was right in the middle of campus. Four minute walk from the stadium. Oh. Ideal. If it wasn't for them, we're driving what an hour and a half with traffic back from Indianapolis yeah. to fucking Bloomington. We'd been fucked. Ter- we're not working out terrible. Yeah. Fucked. Like we probably wouldn't be able to go out Saturday night. No, no way. way. We have. No way. Another thing that sucked was we never were able to get into. We never got in contact with someone from Kilroy's, which yeah. is their only bar there. Yeah. Which really sucked because we didn't. Be, we weren't able to film like an actual bar night there. Yeah. Sure. Um, but we did nonetheless still go. Yeah. A little overrated, not gonna lie. Very. Uh, very, very overrated. Is it Roy's or sports? Animals got kicked out. Sorry, is it, there's two. So there's Roy's. Cock, there's cock and sports. Kill Roy's on cock Kirk, and there's sports. There's Kill Roy's on Kirk. Wait, which one did we get denied from? So the very first night, we, or the, the Saturday night, we went into Kilroy's on Kirkwood Cock. Yes, Cock. And yeah. we were like, we don't have any contacts here. We tried getting in contact, no one replied. We walked in just, we were like, okay, yeah. fuck it. We're just gonna walk in with the mm. camera. Yeah. We walk in, we go to the back courtyard, places places bump, and it was, it was a good time. But the security sees us with the camera and was like, yo, like, you gotta, gotta go. Like, you're yeah. allowed to have that in here. And we're like, holy fuck, like, we're not gonna be able to film, like, this entire night. Yeah. And then we were, Rick was like, yo, like, Chanchi, like, talk to this guy. And I was like, fuck, <laughs> all right. Yo, dude, like, we're filming for YouTube, like, we heard your place, I'll just suck in his cock. Because, like, we heard your place <laughs> was the best, back. you know, like, we really just want to film it, like, we're rating, we're rating this place, and he's like, you know what? 
Fine. And then he, we got extra, took Rick upstairs yes. on top of the place so he's able to see like the entire bar from above. He was on top of like the roof at one point getting downward shots. So the guy ended up hooking it up, um, which was good. Moving on to Ohio State. This is a great school. <laughs> I actually really like Ohio State. Very sneaky good school. Sneaky that good. Was. Like honestly, every single night we went out was actually like a really fun time. Unreal. Yep. I'm sad I missed it. Oh. Yeah. That was a bad school to miss. That was a bad. You might have missed the best night of my life. That was. That like, was honestly, the best bar night of my life. Like, we're looking like, that was so much fun. I've, like, well, never. The people, or was it? Oh, dude. Well, the whole egg, everything about it was just coming really sick. Yeah. Thursday night, midway on high. That's when you guys had the bodyguards, too? Yeah, dude. <laughs> I mean, security. Yeah. <laughs> security. But it was like. So I remember the Instagram, like leading up to the bar night, midway on high, the management was great. Starting from the main guy, awesome, they set us up great, they said we were gonna get uh, just right in front of the DJ, we're gonna block you guys off, cool. Cool, awesome, sounds great. And I remember in the DMs, like looking back, and I was like, yo, we got a lot of messages, which we didn't get in the first three schools. We got a lot of messages of people, yo, I'm coming to midway tonight, I'll see you there, and I was like, Yo, this is gonna be like, there's gonna be some that people chip here. kept on saying it. I Every, did. You said it a lot, and I was like, dude, like, relax. Like, nah, but like, like, I don't like them. Like, why do you think there's gonna be a lot of You just kept on relax. saying, like, Midway's gonna, dude, like, guys, like, like, I don't know, like, why, but I think this night is going to be absolutely insane. And we get there, um, lines packed, they're waiting for us, park the van right beside the entrance, we get in through a fucking. Oh, first off, they give us first. they give us the three midway well, milks for me, yeah. Chance, and Chip to just absolutely crush down. them. Chance's brilliant idea is like, all right, boys, let's just down it all in one shot. Yeah, yeah we didn't really agree. Yeah, we didn't. We didn't, really we didn't, we didn't agree agree at all. Yeah, we need to get the vibes rolling. Yeah. Also, right when we got out of the like the van, like people were like in line, like screaming Come here, the boys and I was like, whoa. Yeah. And that was like the one night, like I've never been nervous like going out. Like <laughs> I was like actually like nervous to go out. I was like, what the fuck's going on? Like this is like, like unbelievable in a sense. Not it's surreal. Yeah, it, was it was surreal. surreal. Dude, yeah. that's I was like, I was people for. in line are screaming. I'm like, <laughs> okay, like what the hell's going on right we've now? Ne like, we've never experienced that before. Nothing, before. nothing. No, and so we, then we walked through the back door. Yeah. And the security took us, like, was wow. making room for, like, us, like, walking towards this booth. And I was like, like, this is all unnecessary. Like, we don't need this at all. No like, chance. we kind of took in the normal route in no and walked in. And, Squeezing like, we're not going to get harassed or, like, no. anything like that. Like, at the most, like, someone would be like, yo, can I, like, grab a pick, like, on the way in? Yeah. But, like, it was, it, it could have honestly made the people in there more hyped. Which is what yeah. I think. It's like yeah. they, they couldn't get to us. It's like oh my oh my god, I want them. All. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. A little, like, it's just like, like a girl with a boyfriend. Yeah, it sounds like for chances. It's, it's like more like a challenge. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Fuck me. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a joke. I'm just it's a joke. I'm just joking around. No, I think the, that night was incredible. People were screaming like raving all night. Like that was like it wasn't a chill like bar night. It was like raving all night like sing-alongs like just raging headbangers people were giving me their phone like to take yeah. snapchats all night like yeah i was like well what is going on it was, it was popular of the head things right people were giving them yeah people snapchat. were like where yeah. steph was one like where stefan it was, a good, it was a good night too to bring out the most happy dads that we brought to a bar. Yeah, before. we had yes. like a cooler, we had a whole cooler full and of they happy dads. Yeah. Chucking them, bro. Yeah. They would just like throw them at people. People were coming. The you were chucking them. Like, yeah. like I would see one guy, and I had an Instagram story. He had the sign up, so I tossed it at him, and it ended up going like a little viral. Like he was a terrible shotgun. Like the whole thing, like drenched on the side. <laughs> the DMs were like, "Yo, what the fuck? Like I wasted the drink. Why'd you throw it at that guy?" Oh, I do remember. Yeah, this. you remember I the story. Yeah, this. but it was good. Like they were letting us like hand them out. Guys coming to the front, like. Yo, let's drink. Yo, let's drink. And I was like, dude, I was at one point, like, I was like, yo, dude, like, I'm taking down a few here. Like, can I breathe for a bit? Damn. Jesus Christ, dude. I remember, I think the most embarrassing, like, something that I was not used to, because that was all, like, new for us, right? Um, guy in the DJ. So the owner was like, go, go beside the guy in the DJ. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to go. He's, like, secluded, right? So I go up, just hands me the mic. And I'm like, Oh fuck! I have to say something. <laughs> the crowd, right? Like I gotta fire up the crowd, and he's like, "Yo, when the music stops, just like say something." And I was like, "Oh shit!" <laughs> I can imagine, dude. dude. He stops the music. It's like, "Vroom!" And I was like, "Dude, oh my god!" To this day, I'm like, "Oh, stay ready to fire or what?" And it was so bad, dude. Like it was. Wait, no one said anything. No, like it was a couple. Like yeah, and he just turned the music on. He's like, yeah, and I was like. 
Yeah, it was a lesson for me. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, you gotta yeah. now know if you have a mic, like you gotta like, like I shut it on like OH, you know, and then they would have been like IO. Oh, yeah, like, we didn't know that. You gotta learn the so. chance though. That's yeah. the chain. Yeah. OH. OH. And then yeah. they'll be like IO. Yeah. yeah, I was rocking that all game. The student section at the game because they were playing a bad team uh, was pretty bad, okay. so. I was just rocking the OH all game. That yeah, was, you were firing up that stuff. OH! Oh, yeah. Oh, you were firing oh, it up. So also, the frat that we worked with, ATO, Frank, great guys. Unbelievable. They threw down probably my most fun frat, like, of really? ever. Really? Dude, like, the paint, paint party. party. I'm a big theme guy. Oh, yeah. So, so when, when they're chucking so out. I liked it, but. You didn't like it? It was, like, good and all. I would just, like, the paint was just a little After too much. Because you're not a dirty kind of guy. Like yeah, it, you're like I'll get down the, dirty though. Like you're not, it, yeah. It was a lot of fucking paint. Like it's maybe just like spray it out, but it was like buckets. What did it happen at the beginning it's of the night? Party. And then it like pretty much the whole night. Yeah. The beginning of the night. And then you would just like had paint, dried paint on you the entire night. Right? Yeah. Yeah, but that's the fun of a paint party. It's no, it didn't even dry. Dude, I had a bucket. It was so me. thick that my hair was just blue. Oh, like, yeah, his hair blue, was full blue and wet. Blue and wet. Blue and yeah. wet. Blue and wet. Yeah, it didn't dry. I like everything I wore that night. I threw out. Yeah. yeah. At the party, they got drenched, and I wasn't with them at, at first. But some guy got a big paint bucket and was drenching them. And then I'm like, okay, I gotta do it too. Yeah. Took the shirt off. Guy, going. Oh my God. And like, there's not much paint left in this can anymore. So he's like really trying he's to get it hard. Out. And he does one big swing, just smokes my head yeah. with the, the bucket. <laughs> yeah, he smoked it. It starts head. bleeding, and the next day it's like has a big like yeah. bruise, and it was like a cut for a bit. It's gone now. Um, I got a new one. <laughs> Different story. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that that was crazy. And I know you have a, a story from paint party. Yeah. Before. So after the paint party, Don, little old me, was like, "All right, I'm gonna go over to the girl's house." Yes. Most guys probably would be like, "All right, can I shower at your place?" <laughs> Me, I was like, fuck it. That's too much time. Let's get the vibes rolling. So that is a lot of time to take it to take a take fucking a shower, shower, dry off, dry off. What clothes get, are you gonna wear? Exactly. What, what you want? The, the only clothes oh, I brought. What clothes you. are you gonna wear? You know? Yeah, what'd you wear? Yeah, I'll get mine to mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the only clothes I brought were the clothes I wore to the paint party. Yeah. So like, I literally slept in this girl's bed, blue. <laughs> <laughs> did her sheets like did I, her sheets, I, like, I, wait, I, woke, I woke up the next morning I looked in the mirror I'm like oh my god <laughs> like what the fuck am I looking like right now I look at the sheets they're like all blue and shit I I felt really bad but hey did she, she care she, she didn't care, care right yeah she didn't care that was, was she also that covered was, in paint or no no nah, she wasn't that was also the second oh, night I was she with was her, so. oh so the first night you gained that trust yeah so then like, the right. second night you know he's sleeping my bed if he's covered in blue paint yeah and then her friend walked in on us in the morning and was like what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> she just like didn't get it, but like it is what it is. Yeah, because I I also, you know, met up with a friend that night too. But um, I remember showing up. First of all, I'm like chatting with like three girls. Like the whole the girls open the door and they're like, "Who's the Smurf um, at the fucking door?" Like you know, we'll call her Jamie. Jamie, who's the Smurf at the door? And I walk in. I'm just sitting talking for like an hour, covered in blue paint. We get up and I'm like, "Yo, like." Dude, I got a shower. Like, Wait, so came... did you get the couch dirty? No, I was standing. I was standing on oh, like okay, an island just talking. Go upstairs. I'm like, yo, I got a shower, right? Like, I got, I felt gross. Like, it's dried up. Like, I needed to bathe. I'm not getting I can't even sleep. I honestly wouldn't be able to sleep. So, you know, I'm showering. Long ass shower. Like, 20 minutes. And I don't have clothes, right? So, I don't have fucking clothes for this girl. And I, so, I had to ask her. I was like, hey, like, you got anything for me? Like, loose sweats or something? Like, a big tarp? Like, a vintage shirt? I had like Christmas booty shorts that were like fucking high on like they were not that loose and I was like oh fuck like this is a booty shorts and like a fucking an oversized shirt so I looked like didn't brutal. you come home in that I the came next home morning? booty shorts yeah I came That's home normal outfit booty yeah. shorts and a long oversized shirt no no dude like my <laughs> like these are actually like girl booty like, shorts like she so. didn't have anything else she's like I'm sorry like I'm I'm like tough you know like I'm sorry I'm like yo it's fine we, we got the van and uh Matt, our, our videographer, usually drives, so we were driving home, and I was like, yo, do you mind if we go pick up a friend real quick? Um, and it's just me and Mac and Maddie in the car. Rick, I think, already went home. Yeah, I think he went home early. Um, yep. Yeah, so it was just me, Mac, and Maddie in the car, and I was like, yo, like, do you mind if we just go stop somewhere real quick? So we're on the way there, and he's in the front seat, and I'm in the but right behind the <laughs> row behind, and I'm, and I'm like leaning over talking to them, and I see Mac pull out his phone. And then he's texting 
the girl that we're going to pick up. It's not texting. DMing. The girl we're going to pick up, like, 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 hey, or like, what's up? Or like, what are you doing right now? I'm like, I was like, yo, Mac. <laughs> we're going there right now. <laughs> she gets in oh, the car. Fuck me. We, I, I immediately was like, you, you might get a DM from this guy. <laughs> you, you might, you might have gotten a DM. Oh, she didn't open it yet. No, she, well, she hasn't seen it. She didn't reply. I haven't seen it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, yeah, so. Mac <laughs> yeah. was known for a bit over the trip to be a, a Mr. Celia girl. Kind Dude, of. I, yeah, it was, it was a tough night, a lot of drinks that night for me. <laughs> I, I remember like prior to, like a day before, she followed me on Instagram, I was like, fuck it. I was going through my phone just looking like, I'm horny, I'm drunk, I want to have a good night. I was like, fuck it, why not? I didn't realize we are actually going there. Yeah. So those are the four, four school stories for yep. the first podcast. The last thing we're going to do is questions from the fans. First one we got, what was the top frat that we worked with? My personal rep the top, UF Fido. Great guys. Is it again? Sig, uh, Sig at Alabama. Yeah. No. <laughs> Which school? Which school? Sikai. Oh, Sikai. Sikai. Yeah. Sikai. Okay. <laughs> Mine's going to be Phi Psi Alabama, mainly because just the the vibes that they brought were the best, I think. Yeah. I think I like the Great vibes. vibes. I like also Sikai Bama, but like, I don't want to say the same. They yeah, introduced so. it. Phi Psi Alabama. Yeah, yeah, they brought the swing lube into the us. swing lube, yeah. Swing lube. <laughs> I'll, I'll probably go then uh, Sig App at uh, FSU. Met a really good guy, Aiden, there. Yes. Yeah, absolute fucking homie, so. And they have a really nice fucking house on campus. What was the best fraternity party that we went to? Mine. Best frat party that we went to. Again, no tailgates, it's just fraternity party. Uh, pain party. I mean, no pain party Ohio day State. was. Okay. LSU That's, pain party was. was a good day. Awesome. Great production, great dudes. Just paint. Fuck yeah. I'd love to know the amount of money they drop on paint for that day. Oh, no. there, so was, much. there was Thousands. so much. Like, Thousands. They had those big buckets. So that many, big dude. like tubes and shit, dude. I'd close between two. Either It was either the barn night. What? The barn oh, night? Frat party. Oh, the barn. Oh, oh, barn. Oh, barn night. Yeah, yeah barn night, yeah. Um, no, that was probably my favorite. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to go the same. Barn night, Clemson. That was... A vibe. Halloween that weekend. Was fun. Yeah, yeah, Halloween. Halloween definitely piped. Halloween piped it up. definitely inflated that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Was gonna, yeah. But that was. But good time. That was really. That was probably the, like in my opinion, the best like, not production, but like yeah. I don't know. I know like production I know because it was like, yeah, it was. Just yeah, really own, it was a good yeah, spot. It was a very good spot that they had going. Spot. For me, I'd say probably Sick High, Alabama. Just like. Again, the sheer amount of money they put into that and the production they had. B.O.B. 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 It's hard, it's hard to beat. All right, this is a good one. Uh, do you think that some of the lower scored schools had just an off week that happened to be the time that you came? Or was it a justified experience? Whoever asked that, great question. Some schools, yes. Some schools, no. Okay. UNC deserved the low scoring. Agreed. Yeah. Agreed. Yeah. UNC. I, I, I don't think that was an off week. I think yeah. it was just a regular like, no matter week. <laughs> no, it was. Even though I do know for a fact it was their alumni weekend for all the fraternities. So throwing down wise was not an option. UNC seems like the school where their parents come down, like they are all like prepped up. Be be good, you know. To the T. Sorry, Daddy. I'm not drinking yeah, like yeah, more no. than like two beers. Yeah. Sorry, Dad. I'm, yeah. I'm sober. You know, like yeah, no. So I do say I think we came on a bad week, but, but low key when they're gone, they could just fire. Could they could? But nah, I, I don't see. It. Yeah. <laughs> I don't see it. One that got hammered. Miami. And that, I think it's, I think everyone can agree on. New Miami got fucked. Yeah. And I'm talking like. <laughs> Fisted, yeah, like Thanksgiving yeah, I, weekend. I, I think it more so got fucked though for like the frat life there. Yes. I I'll, I'll be honest. The bar scene there for college bars specifically. Yes. Oh, okay. it's, it's it's non-existent. There's maybe two. Question number four. Whew, that's a deep. What was the most important lesson each of you learned on this journey? Let me take a second maybe to think about that a little bit. Next step should start. Okay. 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 It's pretty easy. <laughs> lay off the or yeah probably lay off the alcohol. Yeah. <laughs> no, not not like that, but like take it easy. No, you want to play within it. Yeah. It's a good what two. Make sure make sure Juan doesn't come out six nights in a row. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, Juan. Yeah. Juan That's likes to come out. No, no. When Juan, <laughs> no, I, we, I love we it. Know, we know Juan. I, I like. I think the boys love seeing Juan. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> they I, love I like Juan. They Juan's they may Juan. not know who Juan is though. So. No, they've seen Juan on the golf course. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know who what Juan. Oh, is. They don't know what Juan is. We're saying Juan. They're like who the fuck. Juan. Yeah. Juan's the man. Juan is black. Oh, Juan. Juan's Stefan. Yeah, Juan, my secondary. Well, Juan is like Stefan after like my a couple. My second personality. Juan is not a couple. Yeah, yeah. you need your blacked out and you're going to, I have to carry you home usually after That's Juan, Juan comes yeah. out. That's Juan. Yeah, Juan. Yeah, it's Juan. Right? Yeah. It's a marathon. 
Yeah, that's sprint. what I was just going to say. It's a good one. I think that's the best lesson in this whole context of stuff. And we're going to go behind the scenes business shit. But this, what you guys see on camera, marathon, not a sprint. Um, oof. Who was the worst drunk? I think we, uh, we, we went on that a bit. We went on Juan. Juan was definitely the worst drunk. What does the worst drunk mean? I like guess just drunk, when you're drunk, it's like the dumbest shit. Drunk. Like you're the most annoying. Oh one. my god, dude! Yeah, <laughs> dude! Oh my, let me in! Let me in! Let me in! I had no room, dude. It was like uh, after prom all over again. What do you mean you had no room, dude? You're trying. To <laughs> I love you, and no matter when you're sober or drunk, but when you're drunk, it's like your energy is fucking at three in the morning when I'm trying to sleep. Yeah, like, it's a like, Jesus shit, dude. Like I need you to like dial it. But yeah, I make good stuff on that. Yeah, I'll agree. No, he's definitely the most aggressive and shit too. Yeah, then you want to fight me, dude. He wants to fight everyone. You, like, you, go, you go through stages. Yes. You go through your like yeah. crazy excitement, then you go through like, oh fuck you, I want to fight you. And shit. Yeah. And then you go to like, yeah. and like, okay, carry me home, take me home, please. I've been in Michigan actually. No, but I didn't. Yeah. The ne next question, the craziest thing you've seen all trip. I don't know if it's if this could count. It wasn't with my own eyes, but I remember in uh, Georgia. They were showing us the security footage of oh, uh, my, the bar, yeah, 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 so and it was at 1785. And basically, this guy had a girl on this railing, and like her legs were up, and she was holding onto the railing, and he's just going to town, mucking eating her out, yeah. mucking her barn. That's right. on security yeah. footage. Because it's also in a spot too, where you have to walk by this to go to the washer. It so was in the main it's area. A, it's a prime time spot. It's not like it's in a back corner <laughs> hidden. It's a prime dude, time spot. Literally, ESPN Monday Night Football. Jim, Jimmy's yeah. fucking ten meters deep. He's trying to go take a piss, and he just sees fucking Johnny over here just mucking <laughs> Jessica on the railing. How was the form? A great form? Pretty solid, man. Just like in the air. Just yeah. I couldn't really see his tongue and shit. I don't know. A shit. That, that, is a, that is a good one. You got yeah. pissed on by a female. All right, next question. Create your perfect college, top athletics, top RC, oh, top easy. Greek life. I think this is really easy for me. Go. So, I'm going to go top Greek life. Pretty simple. I think everyone will say so. Alabama, top yeah. athletics, Michigan, and the top bar scene, Georgia. Yo. Oh. Okay. All right, next question. What's the worst and best thing about traveling every week? I think I can. I got this one pretty spot on. I think the best thing about traveling every week is you get to see new spots, see yeah. new people, it's meet new, new people, yeah. and just new experiences. Like I've never been to probably ninety percent of the states. No, no, I haven't been to any of them. Yeah. Yeah. So I think that was the best part about traveling. Worst part was packing. Yeah, shit. being on the move. A lot. A lot, meaning you got to do your own laundry. We had to go grocery shopping every week, and then we had to pack it all up within seven days. So Six like, guys sharing. I think we all have the same, we might all yeah. have the same answer there. Last question, what was the most overrated school? We can say it on three, because I think, yeah, I it's know it is. the same. I know it is. Steph doesn't know it. Yeah, I know it is. <laughs> One, two, three. Miami. Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Oh. I was thinking Wisconsin too, but I think you I, said we didn't do it right. I think with Wisconsin though, because everyone no, said, said Miami party school. Right. That's why. Oh no, honestly. Like, yeah. Everyone was like, no, this is going to be the number one party school. You guys are going to have such a good time here. And it just kind of was a letdown. Because I think I agree everyone's like mind was just set like, oh, this is going to be a sick school. We're starting off probably with the best school of the yeah. trip. And it just didn't live up to what it wanted, yeah. To, what yeah. it wanted to be. I just don't think it lived like all Southern schools or better than it. It yeah. was just, just not it. And I just saw another thing from Barstool U today that they put Wisconsin, I think, at like five in the top ten. Oh, it's pretty with, crazy. With Arizona State at one, Bama at two, and USC, I think, USC, I think it was like, like seven or something Mandy like that. Mandy was four at third or something. <laughs> yeah. Like that answer. All right. Okay. That wraps up the first episode. Recap. Tune in next week. We're going to be talking about West Virginia. Yes. Crazy fucking stories there. <laughs> what the? North Carolina school. and South Carolina. Yeah. Those are some good fucking schools minus UNC. So, yeah. Yeah. Good just stories. The, just the two there. Yeah. Tune in. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Step back. I'm back. We're happy to have. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Who's that? Of course, those two guys. <laughs> One being the boyfriend are walking in, so we're crossing paths. He's going after Steph, not even me. And then. Steph, big guy, he's like, yo, fuck this, pushes him. Uh huh, yes, sir. One push, guy turns, one punch, just clocks Steph in the, the face. Through my window.